Hello everyone, this is my video on how to make a mind map by the website called Coggle. So I'm gonna use the browser called Opera GX browser. So I'm just gonna, gonna click on this. So this is a very nice visual, I mean visual effects browser in which like if I type something like the name of the website so this may so it makes a sound like of a mechanical keyboard so now I'm gonna go and go to this Kaggle one or just go to login so this will now I'll sign in Google I'm gonna sign in with this account so I'm gonna go to create diagram So the topic for my mind map will be instruments so I only know about two instruments which is wind and string so I'm just gonna use these two so tab for adding a new branch and this I'm gonna first start with wind wind now I'm just gonna add one more sub branch will it will be about like how it's used so this in instrument is used to or used by blowing air into it so there is a problem in Kaggle so it's you can say annoying or awkward that like if I add one more child branch this will just shift on this so let me just show you as you can see this is what happens so for um, resolving this error you can just do one thing you can just change its alignment so you can click on this dot and just change it so this is just for subscription for advertisement I don't know why so now if I add one more with this as you can see it will go to the right position so now the problem is resolved now I'm gonna write examples now in examples I'm gonna write um, let's say guitar ukulele sorry actually I was giving it for the stringed in instrument so actually I had to write flute and let's uh, say recorder and trumpet for those who don't know what recorder is it's exact actually a uh, um, like flute related kind of instruments where you just like um, add a noise I mean blow into it for making a noise or sound you can say so I will add the information for the stringed instruments so there you go now here I will write um, stringed instruments instruments so now enter and examples again or first I'll just write the definition or you can say how it works so these instruments work by plucking the strings of the instrument 
so now I'm just gonna add one more now I'm just gonna write the examples so it's the same format like I used in this one so I'm just gonna write it's a guitar like I said like I mistakenly did for these ones guitar ukulele and harp so this is how you can make a mind map now I'm gonna talk about how to edit the, the different kind of features like if you click on this it will give you this dot so you can change the alignment of the string like you can change it here or let's say here like I think this is much better you can also like use this to create as many connections or joints as you want so I'm just gonna go with this only so now this is one of the thing which is really irritating like if I try to do any some kind of like advancement to it like change its position it just shows this so just click on the cross and nothing happens then so now I'm gonna talk about how to format the text so I'm gonna format the text of the instruments the title so you can click on this and it will show these kind of options so for changing the font size you can just go here and just do this so as you can see it has changed the font so you can also change its boldness so for this I'm just gonna do control A which is a key shortcut for pressing all or you can say selecting all so I'm gonna make the text bold so as you can see it is now bold now I, you can also add some kind of images like um, I'm just gonna add one more and just write or instead of this I'll just write or like I'll just click on this and add one more child branch so the branch will name it will be image now one more child branch and gonna click on this you can either do this by like saving an image of the file or you can say image in the in your PC and just checking it out and selecting it but I don't have any image so I'm just gonna go to the net and just find it for from the Google or from Google so guitar images so let's check out electric guitars so this looks nice so I'm just gonna do copy and paste So as you can see this is how to do this now for changing the size you can just go to here and just change its size like this so it's pretty hard to do I don't know why but yeah as you can see so the maximum size is this much so so you will know this when it will let not expand anymore and the smallest size is this so I'm just gonna keep it to the largest size so this is all for this tutorial thank you for watching my video and be sure to like and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit the notification bell